Holy Land Church so beautiful, so great. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. How do you keep in shape? Well, um, right behind you is my trainer. My trainer? Her. Oh, okay. Hi. <laughs> That's how I keep in shape. I work out with weights three days a week for decades. I've been working out with Bubba Andrick, uh, and she's amazing, and I, I lift weights, and I, you know, I, I hike and, do, you know, do this and that when I'm, you know, whatever's going on. If I want to, maybe if I'm somewhere like Miami, I might paddleboard or whatever, but I lift weights, and I I, I tell all, all my girlfriends that we stop creating bone mass around 30, so you should definitely lift weights. And oh it doesn't make everyone's afraid of getting big and bulky. It doesn't do that. It just makes you strong and gives you good bone mass. Um, and she's kept me in the same size I was when I was in high school. That's, that's not, pretty good. Yeah, nobody else in my family is really that right in that, you know, but I'm always trying to get everybody to work out with her, so. That's <laughs> <laughs> so cool. Okay. Now, can I count for his dream? He put Isabella's mommy. You look so much alike. I know, it's crazy. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so, um, okay, so what's it like working with Isabella and Helen Taylor in the film? This is my third uh, project with Holland Taylor. We're currently on Mr. Mercedes together. We were on The L Word as well. Our storylines never cross, it seems like, but she's a friend of mine. I adore her. She's one of my favorite actors. Um, it, and working with Isabella was a dream. She, she came super prepared, um, but not overtrained. Sometimes when I work with kids, it seems like their parents or whoever's working with them has given them too much dick to do. Um, she, she came with her lines uh, memorized and she had a really clear idea about who she was as a person. She's English, so she had to work on her American accent, which was perfect. And she was just open and available and very natural and seemed uh, like a kid to me, not like, a, you know, um, an overly prepared, precocious actress. She's a very genuine and sweet person. And she's, the, you know, she's the reason why the movie works the way it does. She and Holland are really the two stars of the film. And their relationship is, is a really interesting one. Um, and they both... They both made, made their characters uh, really interesting, and there's a lot of tension between them, but when they finally meet each other and come together as family, it's beautiful. Really oh, beautiful. wow. I don't know, you're such a great actress, too. So it's like anything that you take Kelly Lynch in your film, you know it's going to be good. <laughs> okay, cool. Now, can I love your dress and Thank your, you. your purse. Thank you. Thanks. You're the designer? Yeah. I'm going to tell, this is another thing I like to tell girls. You don't have to spend a lot of money to look great. This is an H&M dress that my daughter Shane picked out for me. Oh, my God. And this is a Zara bag. That I love it. It's got a magnet. So I just love it. It looks like something vintage from the 70s. Yeah. And I'm wearing extremely expensive shoes that you don't even see. But so, you know, the, the dress was probably a little over $100 and the bag was probably like $30. I mean, you know, it, what I would say for girls to spend more money on their health, on their workout, on eating right, and, and if you got all that together, you can wear, you can go to Zara, you can go to H&M or to Garber 21 and buy something cute and not have to spend a lot of money. Yeah, you didn't look great, by the way. It's ridiculous. I mean, to spend three thousand dollars, five thousand dollars. I saw a dress recently that I liked, and then I read it was eleven thousand dollars. I mean, <laughs> never. If I had the money, I wouldn't spend that kind of money on clothing. It's crazy. Yeah, you know. Yeah, if it's a thousand dollars, you have to wear it like the rest of your life. You know? That's the point. You know? Yeah. Cool. Well, thank you, Kelly. Thank you, everybody. You're so cool. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks so much. Thank you. Okay, are we here, please? Are we here? Uh, yeah. One more.